vibing to his music. You know, he has right. little headphones on and stuff. Well, I mean, I can't talk too much trash about him considering he is in winner's round three. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so oh, he's he, a Pikachu. He knows what he's doing. Okay. And he's a Pikachu, man. We'd love All to right. see that. I feel like this is a terrible matchup for Pika. Dude, Snake is a tough matchup for a lot of people, but yeah, yeah. Like especially Pikachu. Uh, and Dark. Yeah, Dark knows what he's doing and... Recently uh, made PR. He did. He did boost and level up and get his PR. But yeah, uh, the big thing for Snake, uh, again, that frame one grenade, right? That's, this is so incredibly annoying. And Snake just knows how to close stocks, yes. right? Like, you, you got the up tilt, which is pretty safe uh, way to do it. And then any Snake that knows what he's doing using his recovery is very hard to ledge trap because he's just going to bring out uh, the drone, whatever the hell that's called. I need to know these things. I've been... Yeah, we're, gonna call it a, we're gonna call it a drone. The, it's the a drone. drone, right? Like he's gonna recover high and kind of nullify your ledge guarding game there. So no space on that ground. There. Yeah, oh, comboing off the grenade. That was okay. beautiful. But if you're Pikachu, you are faster. You got to use that to your advantage, and you're kind of small, so maybe you can low profile a couple of these hitboxes. And yeah, that seems to be uh, Uneva's plan. Or I gotta find out how to pronounce his name. As he does have a bit of a percentage lead, is he gonna get the thunder? Oh, Dark able to drift over to the side. But like I said, uh, you make it to winners round three, you know what you're doing. So yeah, yeah this isn't going to be an easy one for Dark. No freebies, no freebies at this point. To yeah, after round three, no freebies. You got to work. Ooh. Keeping a good eye on that uh, C4. Oh, that was was that? He just air dodged. Yo, he's I gonna... can't believe the thunder doesn't kill there, man. He was like 120 some percent. Oh, oh, oh but oh, the up smash oh. will kill at 150. He just rolled right behind. But yeah, so uh, yeah, you saw a little bit of the, the, the head nod from Dark there. It's like, all right, yeah, this is real. This is a match. Yeah, he's like, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to work for this one. You're kind of cooking. Uh, uh, this Pikachu using his ground speed to his advantage. Just being quick, quick stick and move, stick and move with the low percentage, looks for his opening, and then carries through with the rest of the combo there. His edge guarding game is pretty pretty nice. There you go. Oh, lots of patience. Oh. Runs up, doesn't uh, doesn't throw out a hitbox. Let's start. Uh, yeah, let's start. Oh, dies here. I was like, he ran up, no hitbox, let dark spot dodge, and then got the grab off of it. But uh, eventually, that C4, that remote explosion, does close out the stock for dark. But let's see. Oh, the grab into the beautiful. Grenade yeah, great into 33%. There. Yeah, that was beautiful. Instantly, uh, just a little, 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 yeah, try to read the maybe the dash attack or the rolling maybe, but Something. yeah, Dark stays out of the way of that forest match on ledge there. Going high, going high. A couple of trades, are they going to do it again? Ah, oh. <laughs> a couple of trades, they're both rising to that top blast zone. Both players make it back down though. Let's see, whiffing on the grab, they're going to eat it down till four, but nothing else afterwards. The Nikitas are, are getting that shield pretty low yeah. for Pikachu. Yeah, you're not going to want to touch shield for a few seconds here. Ooh. Let it build back up. Let's see the four I seconds. Mean, yep. And then, like I said, that Turn snake knows how to, to clean out stocks, man. That up tilt. Uh, especially, yeah, Pikachu is kind of light. No, so, yeah, it's going to kill earlier than usual. But, uh, but yeah, Uneva doesn't panic. Holds his own and closes out that stack. At only 11% of extra credit. Yeah, that's about as good as you can ask for in that situation. Dude, that grenade is like a get out of combo free card. Like, so frustrating. Yeah, exactly, right? Like I said, it's, it's frame one. Like, you, you just got to be wary of hitting them. But uh, Uneva doing a good enough job here. Actually has a 40% percentage lead. Let's see. Ooh, a little bit of little bit of the nerves from both characters. Oh. This running up and shield. That's that Smash 4 gameplay. Let's just run up and hold shield in each other's face and see what happens. See what Who happens. Who first? Yeah. Let's see. We got the T-Jolts now, right? Now, at this point, uh, Keep it, a good it's distance. A, it, both guys get a little bit tight. You know, he don't want to run into anything. reading those rolls. Those are beautiful. Yeah. Like, oh, oh my look goodness. Look at the way off stage. Disgusting. Good stuff from Neva. Like I was saying, at first, like, yeah, he was playing away, right? He was just throwing out the T-Jolts. So like, all right, percentages are getting up there. It's last lock. You're playing a little scared. And then immediately afterwards, he's like, forget these T-Jolts. I'm going for the kill. I'm going in there. And yeah. Oh, uh, man, he's Uneva sweating, man. The, he's, he's sweating. He's working. Oh, he's got the, <laughs> the, the Adidas tracksuit going on. He, he's dripped. He's dripped up. He's dripped out. Dripped up, dripped out. Mm. Yeah, man, that see. was yeah, that was good gameplay. Good stuff. Good stuff from Luneva there. Uh, does he actually have the full tracksuit? Does he have the Adidas sweatpants with the Adidas He's jogger? The, yo, oh, the drip is bad. crazy. <laughs> I kind of got a root for Luneva The drip is now. crazy. <laughs> he's got the full Adidas tracksuit. I got a root nah, for yeah, him. Now, I got, now he's got to win. <laughs> here we are coming to small battlefield. Uh, Dark with a grenade early to take the first blood here. Uh, let's see the grab. Oh, not able to get any combo off the back throw, though. And yeah, here comes those Here's bread and butters out of Pikachu. Yep. Pika shenanigans. One of these C4s are going to catch at the like worst time for Uneva. Right, like it's <laughs> it's one of those things where like 
the longer this set goes against a snake, the more likely it is to catch you. Like, because you can only occupy your mind with so many things so many at once. Things, yeah. Eventually, you're going to forget about it, and it's going to catch you. Like, the light catch. is going to disappear, and you're going to roll into the wrong spot, and that's just going to be it. There it and is. And there it is. Oh, but the perfect tech. Gotta that make was it a beautiful attack. Into the up smash. Getting, getting punished by the Your up reward smash. for a perfect uh, tech off of the C4 is an up smash as soon as you make yeah. it back. Uh, but yeah, Uneva survives both. Oh, the air dodge was beautiful by Dark. There you go. Yeah, see Dark with the run up and up tilt doesn't quite uh, land doesn't around the shield. Option. The up smash isn't quite going to kill at this percentage. Neither is the forward tilt. What is the All ledge right. trap situation? That was very yeah, interesting for Dark. Yeah, oh, but it didn't matter. Knew. He if you're never, that's a trade you absolutely take. Is he going to down throw? The, the grab. Oh, I, why didn't he just up? Isn't that a high enough percentage to just grab into up tilt? I don't know uh, why you walked away. I don't know. I think, you know, anticipating the rollout or the... Yeah. I was so mixed right there. <laughs> I thought... <laughs> I thought, I thought smash could... attack hit. Yeah. Right? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> I, like, we all saw, like, Pikachu spinning with electricity, right? The smash attack I came swear out. The, yeah, and then Pikachu just exploded. I'm just gonna, I need to look up what the, the hitbox or, or what is Snake's hurt box on whatever that attack was. Is that his up tilt? Are his legs intangible or something? Probably. Uh, but, yeah, here we are in stock two. Pretty close in percentage here. Only separated by six. Grenades are coming out. Let's see. Dark Very playing a little more patiently now. There you go. This, you know, this is this is what you need to always do as Snake. Just fill up the projectiles, up smash, grenades, just a wall of like remote explosive objects. Make your opponent figure out how they're going to play around it. Make them move to you and make the mistake. Yeah, and the up smash there takes it. Like I said, it's just a screen full of dangerous hitboxes, mm -hmm. right? Like how explosive hitboxes, exactly. Yeah, when uh, when Dark is in his bag, like when he's slow and being methodical, he's a really tough out. Let's see if this Pikachu can uh, can close this stock out here and get working on these, Dark's last stock. These air dodges from Dark are a little interesting. There you go. But I mean, I'm sure he's got some idea. He's got something cooking, but. Let's see, grenades, grenades, up smash, grenade. And here come like, the I, got, I got projectiles too. Yeah, exactly. Chill out. Like I, Chill out. I may not have as many, but I got, I got one, one that's really <laughs> effective, right? Like, super effective. Let's see. And there you go. Yeah, see, right? Now the C4 gets scary, right? Because it's going to, oh. <laughs> the light is going to disappear eventually. That's a and, punish. Oh. I saw that. <laughs> Misspaced that uh, smash attack, and Dark gets the free up tilt, closing out the game. Right. So I think the smaller staves there, because small battlefield is a little smaller than PS2, I think mm. that helped out Dark, right? For he was sure. able to take up more space with all of his projectiles. It made Uneva and his Pikachu uh, just have less space to navigate around all that stuff. Yeah. And Dark was able to, to take advantage and get the dub. All right, we got a game three. I wonder where we're going. Uh, Uneva should have one win, though. Right, right now it's saying 0-1, but it should be 1-1. One, one. It's, a, it's a heads up to our production crew there. We appreciate all your, your hard work. I didn't right. see the state selection. I didn't see either. Where are we going? I take it somewhere big. Exactly, right? Gets you some space. Gets you some space to move around if you're Uneva on this counter pick. Perfect. And there, there it is. is yeah. The biggest stage there is here. <laughs> Town and city. Right. So the... Oh, Wait, actually, so it's the side hitboxes are actually, or not hitboxes, but blast ones are yeah. actually a little bit closer. But the stage itself is much larger, and, and the, the top ceiling. Hip and the ceiling is, is much further right. away. Well, so yeah, taller. I like this counter pick from Uneva's perspective. And yeah, like you got more platforms to run away to on the edge. You got to be a little bit careful not to get caught while they're moving, but it's not like uh, it's not like Snake has a rapid jab that's going to hold you into place while the platform oh. is moving or anything. Oh, oh but no. you got exactly what I was talking about. Got to be a little bit careful there. But yeah, and then, you know what? I think the lack of platforms, like when it's in its FB phase, I think might actually Ooh. also help uh, Uneva. Because, right, because Snake's thing is recovering high and then eventually using a platform Ooh. to land. But now if you're patient enough, right, he's going like, to right come down that. eventually. Dark was trying to anticipate the quick attack there and pull the C4 trigger just a little too soon. Little, yeah, oh, I hit. thought he was going to up tilt when the, the Pika air dodge, but he just went for a grab. Yeah. Right now, oh yeah, this, the positioning of that platform meant that even though the t hit the platform, it still came down and hit Dark anyway. Let's see, grenades coming out, landing Is that with a the back air. Oh, oh, he needed the dash attack, didn't quite come out in time, and he ate the big up tilt for it. Don't underestimate Ooh, that was dangerous. flexibility. Oh, never mind. I, I don't know why I thought that uh, side B left Pikachu vulnerable. No, he was able to cancel out the move. Actually, a very safe option. Smart stuff there from Uneva. And now putting up your wall of T-Jolts. Trying, uh, trying to make Snake approach him. 
But yeah, you see, I <laughs> I was hoping that he noticed that uh, that C4 and was able to stay away from it, and he was. But yeah, but this is just where it gets so frustrating. Like you're down a stock, you're trying so hard to close it out, and Snake is more than likely going to live to around 160% on you. Like he is going to make you work for it. Now you've got the tall ceiling, like I said. Now you got Snake with full rage. Yeah. It's getting really scary. You really, really want to finish the stock. Dark this is not going to give it to you. You get frustrated. As much go. as I was saying the, uh, the stage pick was good, this might backfire on yeah, uh, you never, like now you never, because he, he was getting yeah. all the up smash kills. Like kills I said, and smash. now like you're dying sub 100% to a tilt attack. That's got to be frustrating. Frustrating. Uh, I you have to the bag and now slowly right. slipping away. Right, so sub 100% on this stage's ceilings, right? So that's a really high thing, and it's still killed. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's rough business out here for whatever does get the dash attack kill there, but then all the projectiles that Dark left on the stage runs him up to 60%. Um, it would take, this would be a very impressive reverse 3-0. I'm not sure if Uneva has it in him, but we'll see. Like, he's going to have to slow the game all the way down, but the thing is, Snake has so many projectiles. Doesn't exactly yeah, how do you get off the ledge? Away. How do you maneuver? Yeah, gets a, a couple of back airs there, stays away from the grab. Oh, there it goes, Dark. Oh, never mind. So he gets back That's to stage, attack. good shield on that dash. The quick attack has just enough range, but then he gets grabbed. He up Start airs and quite going to take him. it. Just throw out those walls. One of them's going to hit. Yep. Back in. The landing up smash there doesn't quite kill, but yeah. All Dark has to do is kind of sit back now. Just yeah, let right these projectiles now it's, do it's the feeling work. Like, it's feeling like Thanos. It's, it's feeling inevitable. Oh, he threw the Oh, he delayed the nair. <laughs> Why doesn't he nair, just the do jab. the up tilt? That's twice now. He's got the grab kill confirmed. There's got to be something that we don't know. That's I why, know, yeah, I, that's assuming, why yeah, he's smarter he's than me. I'm it. assuming there, there's a reason. He's smarter than me, and that's why he's not doing Up it. Up Oh. But yeah, um, the back throw isn't quite going to kill. Let's see if Uneva can, can he clutch out one stock. It doesn't look like it. Oh, oh good air dodge. Uneva. That was beautiful. Right there. And the, the back throw, throw kill. Finishing out the the stock. DI mix up there. Massable stuff from Dark. Uh, Uneva was able to take game one. Very strong stuff for him. But yeah, uh, at the end of the day, Dark locks in and cleans up. Uh, so yeah, bracket moving along. Was, I think yeah. we're going to stay in winner's round three for the next matchup, if I'm not mistaken. I'm I might sure. be. That was good gameplay from you, never though. Yeah, uh, very entertaining. Hopefully, uh, you always love the name correctly. <laughs> yeah, you always love when a set goes to three games. Nobody yeah. dominating the other. Like that's good high level competition right there. So right. Uh, yeah, Uneva's night is far from over. He still has a chance to make a good losers run. Yes, he does. Coming up next, oh, a couple of well known names around these parts. We've got Slashy and Moru. So okay. we want to see me, me brawler. brawler versus Cloud. Yeah, it's gonna be um. Got to be good stuff there. Stuff, yeah. I, I think Cloud has the, the tier list advantage here. I feel like most people would probably give it to Cloud over uh, me Brawler. But, dude, Slashy's me Brawler's nasty. I've seen him at, uh, at Hashtag 